फ्रेंड्स आई एम परविंदर रंधावा फ्रॉम आई बी एस एल इंडिया यू आर वॉचिंग माई यूट्यूब चैनल डेट्स परविंदर रंधावा गुरु दिस इज माई लिसनिंग क्लास इन दिस आई एम गोइंग टू डू द सेक्शन थ्री एंड द बुक इज कैमरा इज थर्टीन टेस्ट थ्री एंड सेक्शन इज थ्री इन विच आई हैव टू डू द क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम फर्स्ट आई एल टेक फ्रॉम ट्वेंटी वन टू ट्वेंटी फोर एंड दीज आर द एम सी क्यूज देन आई एल वर्क ऑन एन अदर क्वेश्चन वेयर दिस इज द पॉइंट हेयर Here I have to find the problem, and these are from twenty-five to thirty. So let's start the class first. I'll play the audio, then underline it also. Underline, then we'll work accordingly. And you are watching my YouTube channel. That's Parvinder Dawa Guru. Please subscribe my channel so that you can get the noti notifications. So let's start, and the test is just in front of you. Fine. The equations are from twenty-one to twenty-four. Book is Cambridge thirteen, test three, section just in front of you. You can have an eye, but in exam you have to use the pencil. I am using pen in this test also. So let's start it. Section three. You will hear a textile design student called Jim discussing his project on using natural dyes for coloring fabrics with his tutor. First, you have some time to look at questions 21 to 24. Listen carefully and answer questions twenty-one to twenty-four. Okay, Jim, you wanted to see me about your textile design project. That's right. I've been looking at how a range of natural dyes can be used to colour fabrics like cotton and wool. Why did you choose that topic? Well, I got a lot of useful ideas from the museum. You know, at that exhibition of textiles. But I've always been interested in anything to do with colour. Years ago, I went to a carpet shop with my parents when we were on holiday in Turkey, and I remember all the amazing colours. They might not all have been natural dyes. Maybe not. But for the project, I decided to follow it up, and I found a great book about a botanic garden in California that specialises in plants used for dyes. Okay. So in your project, you had to include a practical investigation. Yeah. At first, I couldn't decide on my variables. I was going to just look at one type of fiber, for example, like cotton, and see how different types of dyes affected it. Yes. Then I decided to include others as well. So I looked at cotton and wool and nylon. With just one type of dye. Various types, including some that weren't natural, for comparison. Okay. So I did the experiments last week. I used some ready-made natural dyes. I found a website which supplied them. They came in just a few days, but I also made some of my own. That must have taken quite a bit of time. Yes, I thought it'd just be a matter of a teaspoon or so of dye, and actually that wasn't the case at all. Like I was using one vegetable, a beetroot, for a red dye, and I had to chop up a whole pile of it. So it all took longer than I'd expected. One possibility is to use food colourings. I did use one. That was a yellow dye, an artificial one. Tetrazine. Yeah, I used it on cotton first. It came out a great colour, but when I rinsed the material, the colour just washed away. I'd been going to try it out on nylon, but I abandoned that idea. Were you worried about health issues? I thought if it's a legal food colouring, it must be safe. Well, it can occasionally cause allergic reactions, I believe. Before you hear the rest of the discussion, you have some time to look at questions twenty-five to thirty.
listen and answer questions 25 to 30. So what natural dyes did you look at? Well, one was turmeric. The colour's great. It's a really strong yellow. It's generally used in dishes like curry. It's meant to be quite good for your health when eaten, but you might find it's not permanent when it's used as a dye. A few washes and it's gone. Right. I used beetroot as a dye for wool. When I chop up beetroot to eat, I always end up with bright red hands. But the wool ended up just a sort of watery cream shade. Disappointing. There's a natural dye called Tyrian purple. Have you heard of that? Yes. It comes from a shellfish, and it was worn in ancient times, but only by important people, as it was so rare. I didn't use it. It fell out of use centuries ago, though one researcher managed to get hold of some recently. But that shade of purple can be produced by chemical dyes nowadays. Did you use any black dyes? Logwood. That was quite complicated. I had to prepare the fabric so the dye would take. I hope you were careful to wear gloves. Yes, I know the danger with that dye. Good, it can be extremely dangerous if it's ingested. Now, presumably you had a look at an insect-based dye, like cochineal, for example. Yes, I didn't actually make that. I didn't have time to start crushing up insects to get the red colour. And anyway, they're not available here. But I managed to get the dye quite easily from a website. But it cost a fortune. I can see why it's generally just used in cooking and in small quantities. Yes, it's very effective, but that's precisely why it's not used as a dye. I also read about using metal oxide. Apparently, you can allow iron to rust while it's in contact with the fabric, and that colours it. Yes, that works well for dyeing cotton. But you have to be careful as the metal can actually affect the fabric, and so you can't expect to get a lot of wear out of fabrics treated in this way. And the colours are quite subtle. Not everyone likes them. Anyway, it looks as if you've done a lot of work. That is the end of section three. You now have half a minute to check your answers. So that's the end of section 3. So it started with MCQs as we did here. Now what are the specific words how the you can say there are two speakers uh, Zim and Not another one and so how they worked uh, right. So what's the main thing because the first point in which I, I underlined that is this one first. So first inspired he talked about the exhibition also but he told that years ago I went to and I went to holiday right where I saw the work right of die and even if he talked about but uh, the thing is that first he uh, just like he had a word on exhibition then uh, after that he went to this one that he I think he went to Turkey right that he talked then he went to the book also but the first i have to work on this one that is what is first here what is the first point on which the speaker spoke the main thing is that one okay so that's why uh, these kind of uh, words are there when first second numbering system is there or connectors are there or uh, when type of words just underline eventually that's why underline this is the reason here Right. So then, uh, this is the. That's why the answer is C. And in this is a you can say a practical investigation when he went. Right. First he talked about the one. Then then he uh, uh, kind of he used a connector and he moved to the next line. And then he used about the various dyes with different fibers. So that's the because if I uh, I I can't give the uh, B also I can't give the C also right why because there is written one die by the person person is talking about the various right that's the point here and I think you listened also when doing his experiment because he uh, went to a website and he ordered also so she talked about the time but what kind of time in delivery time and what is written about the time here the time he had to leave the fabric. No, there is a difference. Time word is there, but what's the point of time? That is a delivery time. So that's the reason of the time here. Because mostly uh, we are puzzled that time is 
just like the speaker is talking about the time naturally the answer is c but the answer is a what's the reason of a so you can check how much natural material was needed to make the dye so that's why he went to a website also he was surprised by this one right so natural because uh, and if you can check one thing also in this what's the game plan of uh, this one that from 22nd to 25 uh, 23rd within one second the question is shift, shifted to 23rd within one second right but then it took the time when they reached to 24 right when they reached to 24 then the problem they have to they, they were talking and it, he said about the washed away yes after jello dye that's why i have written here so they washed away so not a permanent one right and yes he talked about the nylon also but he he talked in this manner he spoke that abandoned that he abandoned the idea of nylon he abandoned the idea of nylon that's the thing that's why c is the not the answer b is the answer if i am uh, just like you can check again what i am trying to say first i picked holiday that's why the answer as a result practical investigation on the various that's the that's why the answer when doing he was surprised by the how much natural material was needed and problem that is washed away and why not nylon because he but then he went to another that is questions that is from this one you can say that from 25 to 30 so regarding this you did these questions that is 25 to 30 let's manage the sheet so here we have to find the problem right and these are the natural dyes so regarding the first one that is 25th it's not permanent so which is not permanent that is not long lasting similar words try to check the thing what i am trying to do what i am trying to do not permanent not long lasting then second beetroot fine so unexpected why because he i think what i remember red color but it uh, came out to be green that's the thing here so that's why so that's the thing here so f is the answer so don't be just like miscalculate it fine in 27th that is purple it's a uh, why the answer is i because it's a rare fine availability is rare so there is not generally same language and logwood what's the language dangerous be careful and cochineal so what's the language here right because it's very we can say in small quantity it's a kind of that's why it's going used it and regarding because it damaged the because it is used for rusting iron this kind of language they used and it is effects the fabric that's why e damage so it means there is you can check there is a match of one word or maybe two words it matches answer is just in front of you so it means we need better here we need concentration also we need the matching technique also we should know the meaning of the words also similar words also but mostly these words are common mostly Right. We we have the knowledge of connectors also. We have the knowledge of what, when, why. These kind of words also, Ws and H, how. So these kind of words we have to use. So this is the part. And you are watching my YouTube channel. That's Parvinder Randhawa Guru. Please subscribe my channel, like, comment, and share. Thanks for your nice response. So in this, I have done the section third. That is Cambridge thirteen test three. So in next video, you will find the section four also. that is mostly with the blanks in section 4 this is related to mcqs and this is finding from the box fine so remain stick to this now let's talk in hindi yahan maine questions kare that is 21 se 24 21 mein jo maine word underline kara ye natural dyes ka tha wo listening aapne sun hi liya maine first word ko underline kiya ye cambridge 13 test 3 se liya gaya pehle wo bola ki main exhibition mein gaya फिर वो बोला कि उससे पहले मैं एक हॉलीडे गया था टर्की के अंदर जहाँ मैंने ये चीज़ देखी थी राइट तो मुझे तो फर्स्ट की बात है उसके बाद बोला फिर मैं एक बुक भी देखी जो कि इसके ऊपर है लेकिन मुझे तो फर्स्ट के ऊपर ध्यान देना था इसलिए सी मेरा आंसर है ट्वेंटी सेकेंड के अंदर जो उसने कहा कि एज ए प्रैक्टिकल इन्वेस्टिगेशन थी उसने कहा पहले मैंने स्टार्ट किया वन 
ठीक है डाई के तो मुझे लगा कि नहीं मेरा सी हो सकता है तो उसने कहा नहीं मैंने फाइबर भी ज़्यादा ले लिए तो मैंने बी को भी रिजेक्ट कर दिया फिर उसने कहा वेरियस तो यहाँ पे क्या लिखा हुआ रेंज ऑफ डाइज विद डिफरेंट फाइबर्स सो इसलिए मेरा आंसर क्या बन गया यहाँ पे आपका फिर द्वारा ए बन गया तो यो लैंग्वेज को खुद ही क्रॉस कर रहा था और इसमें यह सबसे बड़ी बात यह है कि मुझे जिम के ऊपर ध्यान रखना है दूसरे पर्सन पर बिल्कुल ध्यान नहीं रखना वो मुझे पसल करेगा करेगा When doing his experiment, Jim was surprised कि उसको natural material कितना चाहिए था उसने कहा मैंने website पर भी contact किया इसीलिए कर रहा ना हाँ ये चीज़ आपने नोट की होगी ट्वेंटी सेकेंड के एक बाद एकदम ट्वेंटी थर्ड उसने स्टार्ट किया ट्वेंटी फोर तक जाने में उसने टाइम लिया था ट्वेंटी थर्ड के बाद ट्वेंटी फोर लेकिन ट्वेंटी सेकेंड के बाद उसने सडन स्टार्ट किया था ट्वेंटी थर्ड को तो ये चीज़ें आपने नोट रखनी है एग्जाम के अंदर जब वो गया ट्वेंटी फोर्थ में उसने कहा प्रॉब्लम अब एक चीज एक चीज़ और नोट करनी जो मैंने अभी इंग्लिश में बोली है एक वर्ड मैचिंग दो वर्ड मैचिंग की गेम है सारी राइट right. इस तरह प्लान की जाती है लिसनिंग कि मतलब प्लानिंग जो मेरे जो क्वेश्चंस मैनेजमेंट होती है जो आ, ये ऑप्शंस मैनेजमेंट होती है वो इस तरह की जाती है कि पर्सन सिर्फ सिमिलर वर्ड्स को ट्रेस करे और आंसर जरूर देगा अगर सिमिलर वर्ड्स को ट्रेस करता है फिर कहता है जिम हैव यूजिंग राइट तो उसको फेब्रिडाइज की प्रॉब्लम क्या थी उसने ये भी कहा कि मैंने भाई वास्ट वे हो जाती है ठीक है फिर उसने एक चीज हो रही यहाँ पे कि मैं नाइलॉन पे भी करना चाहता था मैं लेकिन मैंने अबेंडन कर दिया लेकिन यहाँ पे लिखा हुआ है नाइलॉन पे इन है तो लैंग्वेज मेरी गलत हो जाएगी लेकिन हम एग्जाम में नाइलॉन सुन के फटाफट आंसर सी दे देते हैं तो इसलिए आपको ध्यान देना होगा जब मैं गया क्वेश्चन ट्वेंटी फाइव टू थर्टी पे वर्कआउट किया तो ये प्रॉब्लम सोचे सर्च करनी है जैसे टॉर्मिक की बात की तो इसमें कहा कि ये नॉट परमानेंट है जो मैंने वर्ड कंप्लीट नहीं लिखा उस टाइम क्योंकि लिसनिंग स्पीड में थी तो इससे मेरा आंसर मिल गया मुझे डेट इज लॉन्ग लास्टिंग राइट तो ये चीज है मेरा आंसर दे देखिए और बीट रूट पे जब वो गया तो उसने बड़ा क्लियर किया कि मैं चाहता कोई कलर था मिल कोई कलर गया मैंने अनदर इसीलिए लिखा था ये ए एन ओ टी एच ई आर जिसका मतलब मेरा अपने आप अनएक्सपेक्टेड रिजल्ट्स मिले उसे जब वो पर्पल पे कहा तो उसने कहा कि ये रेयर है रेयर में नेचुरली आपको एकदम क्लैरिटी आएगी नॉट जनरली अवेलेबल लॉकवुड में जब वो जाता है तो वो कहती वो दूसरा पर्सन भी कहता है डेंजरस है तो क्योंकि प्रॉब्लम जो थी ना ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इसमें किसी का नाम नहीं दिया था तो मैं दोनों पर कंसनट्रेट कर सकता हूँ तो ये चीज़ आ गई आपकी जो जब नेक्स्ट पे गया तो कहता है स्मॉल क्वांटिटी में यूज़ होता है क्योंकि ये बहुत वो है फाइन एक तरह का एक्सपेंसिव है तो ये रीज़न आ गया मेटल ऑक्साइड पे कहता है तो बड़ा क्लियर करता है कि ये जो जनरली आयरन के लिए यूज़ होता है बट ये फैब्रिक पे क्या कर सकता है दूसरा पर्सन कहता है हमारे को जो फीमेल है कि ये डैमेज भी कर सकता है फैब्रिक को तो इसलिए मेरा आंसर ये थर्टी जो कैच हो गया मेरे से ये रीजन रीजन है इनके आंसर्स के जो मतलब कि मेन आप वही चीज नोट करके रखिए कि जस्ट गो विद वन वर्ड वन टू वर्ड्स को अच्छी तरह समझिए आपके आंसर साथ की तरह अगर आपको पे एग्जाम में लगे मेरी एक टेक्निक और लगी है सपोज करो कि मुझे नॉट परमानेंट तो रफ में नॉट परमानेंट लिख लो बाद में आंसर सर्च कर लेना ये ना हो कि आप वहाँ सर्च करने के आइडिया में इतनी आपकी लिसनिंग जो आगे मूव कर जाए इसके मतलब आपको फटाफट ये ऐसे नोट्स बना लेने चाहिए राइट सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एट्स परविंदर रंधावा गुरु सो डैट यू कैन गेट द नोटिफिकेशन फाइन प्लीज लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर यू आर आई एम डूइंग द राइट वर्क यू आर ऑल्सो प्रिजिंग माई राइट वर्क थैंक्स वंस अगेन फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो अगेन आई वॉन्ट टू से वन थिंग इन एम सी क्यूज इफ द नेम इज रिटन एज जिम जस्ट ट्राई टू कंसनट्रेट ऑन जिम ओनली नॉट ऑन द अदर पर्सन द अदर पर्सन विल मेक योर आंसर रॉन्ग रिमेंबर दिस थिंग whose name is written just concentrate on that person just concentrate on that person that's the surety you will get the right answer second similar words try to search the similar words try to listen it properly if you find the similar words naturally you will get your answers in a right manner your answers are always right as i told in my previous video also for general people eight band is a must requirement for immigration in some countries right eight means you have to achieve 38 39 so that's why every section is important to you so let's do section 4 in the next video right please subscribe my channel so that you can get everything according to your test whatever you want thanks for subscribing this channel also thanks for watching this video